crazy. Mr. Goodbar. I love you. Come here. <laughs> Have another. She's 
just gonna lie. I can't take it anymore! I'm up every day at five! Every day at five! Go take a shower, go for a jog, wake Sally, cook breakfast, something healthy, egg whites, flax, kale, organic coffee, sprout and wheat, sit down at a table with Dave and Sally for breakfast, eat a tiny portion, be sure to leave some on the plate, all the food is on the plate, get dressed, something feminine and flattering, kiss Dave goodbye, give him a little something for coming back home to, check on Sally, comb her hair, pack her lunch, wait with her for the bus, hug her goodbye, make sure that hug lasts all day long, that she feels your arms around her, and even at recess when the mean kids pick on her because their moms don't hug them enough. Then let go, watch her walk away. Choke back your tears, taste the salt sliding down the back of your throat. Go back inside, check yourself in the mirror, Ugh. turn around, turn back hoping to see someone else, Cross through the kitchen. Pause. Feel the quiet of the empty house. No one's watching. What can you eat? Open the pantry. Look inside. Take that jar of peanut butter. Unscrew the lid. Take a whiff. <sighs> Stick your finger in a jar of peanut butter. Lick it off. Feel like someone's watching you. Shit. Turn around and face them. No one's there. Put the jar of peanut butter away. Wash your hands. Be sure to remove any trace of peanut butter. Reapply lipstick. Head out the door to work again. You used to be fat. M&M. Oh, please. I know her type. How much? My stomach hurts. How much? A hundred? Huh? How much? A hundred what? Pounds. Come on, how much did you lose? This isn't fun anymore! She stole hard-earned Halloween candy from her daughter, ditched work, and checked herself into a seedy motel to eat it. There's something wrong with me. She can't help it. I'm a terrible person. I bet at least 110. Am I right? You lost 110 pounds? Why 110? Because she's got at least a whole other person in here. And she walks like she used to walk? Okay, that wasn't nice. Here's a cold thing you feel better. Here, have some Starburst. Tootsie Rolls. I don't want it! Sure you do. It always makes you feel better. No amount of candy will be enough to bury it for good. To make you forget about the chubby little girl who nobody loves. Who eats melted cheese on a plate and sweets French fries when nobody's looking. And eats M&M's like we're candy-coated pieces of happiness. You are candy-coated pieces of happiness. Thank you. I'm we try. <laughs> you better not. Yeah, you probably shouldn't. Why? Uh, cause you'll get fat. I'm already fat. No. She's sad on the inside. m, &M. Maybe you should, uh, you know. I don't do that! Either. Then what are you gonna do? What are you gonna tell Sally? She'll probably be missing her candy. And Dave? You're just gonna have to pretend like this never happened. Buy more candy for Sally. Fill the pumpkin, put it back in her room, cook a healthy dinner. Vegan butternut squash soup and baby arugula salad. With pine nuts. With pine nuts. You're just gonna have to pretend like it's never happened. You're good at that. Lying. So can for my own daughter. It's okay. She didn't eat this whole pumpkin and not eat a pound. I know. Poor Sally. I won't do it again. I know you won't. You can learn how to squash soup. And baby arugula salad. With pine nuts. A healthy supper. Sit down at the table. Like any other day. And say grace.
It'll be all okay. Okay. And if not, 